That spot called luck is where preparation and opportunity meet, and it ain't always good luck. Accept the bad luck. Don't blame the fish. Try as best you can, but remember who's who's the king of the mountain. It's the fish. You know, treat them like that. I run the Calypso and have done for 30 years, the whole east coast of Australia, um, from Cairns in the north to Bermagui in the south. Um, it's been pretty well all my life. My father was into the tuna fishery down there at an early time and his thing that he really wanted to do was catch a marlin and um, he was very dedicated and I came along for that ride. And Once he'd done that, we moved from Burmy to Naruma and then to Port Stephens over the years and I was with him every day or every day I could. And, when we moved to Port Stephens, it was a whole new world. The fishery here was, I wouldn't say infant, it was, it'd been going for a long time, but certainly around 1996, it went to a whole new level with the striped marlin fishery. of the Great Barrier Reef's gladiators radiating her silver sides and turquoise back and flashing in the sun. Stake a claim, book a boat and climb aboard. We'll see you off the Great Barrier Reef. And good luck and good fishing. Well, everyone always read about Cairns in the books. If you weren't reading Big Fish and Blue Water when you were growing up, Gobi's book, you know, you'd, your heart wasn't in the, into the fishing and, you know, Everyone I know has a copy of that book. If you reckon Port Stevens was on the map, for the young Marlin crewmen come captain like me that loved it, it was always gonna be somewhere I went to. So 1994 rolls round and I got my first crack to go up there. top of the tree, we call it the Everest of angling and people will come from all corners of the globe to climb that mountain. But you, you have to respect the fish, you have to prepare for the biggest and best fight ever, so your stuff's got to be good. You want to catch the fish as quick as you can and if you want to get rid of the fish, get rid of it. Thank God for circle hooks. Yeah. That is the best thing that's happen for, for marlin fishing, for sure. It's, it's helped you catch more fish for a start and it'll help you catch that, that one again. He'll, he'll, he'll be there, you know, that's it.